My name is Rafi Media Villa from Criticologos.com. Thank you, Nina, for taking the liberty to talk about this series. Um, I'm coming to you live from San Juan, Puerto Rico, so we're going to talk about that. Love it. Yeah. So, again, first question has to be, and I've asked everyone, because I want to know how you all reacted to, to you know, shooting down here, dealing with our humidity and our lovely weather. <laughs> Did you survive? Were you able to survive? <laughs> we survived. We had so much fun. I mean, I think, I think it, it's definitely a big shift to go from, like, fast-paced, like, New York or L.A. to, like, island time. But, I mean, it's so beautiful over there. and we really all bonded um, at like the beaches and at the rainforest and we went hiking and you guys have like an incredible, like, like we went out in old San Juan, like every weekend and we had, yeah, we had so much fun out there. I, and I don't think we'd have, we would have had that much fun had we been in New York or in LA or, or somewhere else. That's good. I'm, I'm good to hear you have one. That's, in, that's important. I, I, I want to ask you, this is one of your big, I mean, you, you may correct me if you want to, but is this one of your biggest, new, your first big project? And, and you, obviously you had to work alongside uh, Nick, Nick Offerman, obviously, but also you, you had, your, your body is in the poster. So I want to know, how did you react when you saw the, the, the hate? So I'm in the poster of the, of the promo of the you know the, the project how how was your reaction to that oh i i mean th this is this is wild like a year ago like like not even a year ago like six months ago i i wouldn't have thought that would have been possible i was in a very different place like six months ago so seeing that i'm just i feel so lucky and i feel so lucky that it was this project that um that that I got because it's, it's the writing is incredible. The team is incredible. The directors were all incredible. Like Andy, Ciara, Ben Sinclair, like Sam Esmail, Chad Hamilton, Allison Miller, like just that group. And then this cast, like it's, it's a dream come true. And let's talk about working with Nick. Did he give you any pointers? Did you learn something from him? Or did he did it? Just, just do what you want. No, no, no. <laughs> a, a little bit of everything. I mean, he was, great and and us in scenes together you know I I really had to kind of calm myself down and be like just play off of him like that's all you got to do and um he was so kind and so generous and giving and one of our scenes I think was was improvised um where we're talking about chopsticks he was actually teaching me how to use chopsticks because he had spent like a year in Japan and like Yeah, so, and, and he's just, he's just so gracious and has so many stories. And I learned a lot on screen and I learned a lot off screen from him. You also work with Tyler and you, you obviously you had a lot of such things that, that, uh, in the others, in the, the flip side of the story uh, with Tyler. And he's also somebody that had done so much in his career already. Did he gave you any pointers? How fun was it working with him? He, he seems to be like a jokester and you can correct me if you want to. <laughs> He is. I mean, he is and he isn't. He can he's very um, he's always very prepared and very like on it and um, and and just a, like a master. And, and you can see his um, the way he prepares changes from project to project. And I think that was really interesting to uh, talk to him about and talk about how, you know, he like prepares for a scene because I come from like more of a theater e background where I did a lot of theater in college and um so switching to film and tv was you know kind of a, a a big change with preparation and everything so talking with Skylar about it was great and and he was such an easy person to work with and talk to and everything yeah I, one one final question and I'm gonna let you go I promise uh how did you relate to Violet in her situation when when it, this, this flips on the story because of everything that happened and and I think that Violet is something that a lot of girls are gonna relate to when it when it comes you know with going to dealing with her dad and and the yeah. whole uh growing up as a kid so how did you relate to Violet in, with, with the character yeah I mean I related to her massively uh she's she was going through the loss of a parent and when I got this role I was going through the loss of a parent and uh we were dealing with it in different ways but I think it's really uh important to show uh grief at that at that age and how hard it is to talk to your parents 
about it and be vulnerable with your parents and um also showing that grief isn't always so sad there's it's numb it's mm-hmm. it can be you know you, you can poke fun at it sometimes and her uh I think her relationship with Skylar really uh shows that and showcases that that you don't have to be talking about it and everything it can just sit there and that's okay Nina, again, thank you for your time and congratulations on the series. I absolutely love it what you guys did. And I, I, I'm glad you guys had fun down here. Yeah, thank you so much.